up ahead. White moose. There. Oh, wolves. Oh, no, they let it. From now on, I shall call you Roly Unega. You Red Wolf. Your channel. Ah, fitting name. I like that one. I can all show you my house. How about that? We have a nice little housewarming party. If we're all traveling together, like great caravan of tribe. Indeed it will. I was going it's to say it's tribe, a caravan. Mate. What do you mean? It's my invite, brother. Or it's just... Me, no, we're speaking in generals. Mate. Imagine the sheriff's rocking up and they see all of us, mate. They'll be thinking, what the fuck are we doing? Caravan's rolling up. <laughs> this is amazing. God damn. Oh. Whoa. Oh god. Apologies, donkey oh. is old. Look at how majestic he is on his donkey. Only beginning of great journey, friend. I. It's going to be a long one, but not too long. I think we may have lost our friends back there. Skinny Listen. and house. Where would they have gone? I'm not too sure. They were just behind us and then they went missing. Does Horace know the way to St. Denis? I think he should. Well, then he will be okay. They shouldn't be too far behind, I don't think. We lost them. I think we turned right, they went left. He was just asking about missing friends. Them. Where, what happened? I'm sure they will be fine. They shouldn't be too far behind. Hopefully. First time down this way. Never seen swamp quite like this. No, I would uh, suggest staying on the path around here though. And the, uh, the crocodiles like to lurk around. User joined your channel. Thank you for warning. You know, I mean, that's another thing to hunt. This is true. I we could make a endeavor of that one day. Ah, it's all good. I will handle this. Here, I think the horse is I will handle this. Up. Why would they? Are you okay? I don't think I can skin it. I thought I might be able to bring it with us. Front gate. Hmm. I this place is like a fortress. Oh, oh my Welcome god. Welcome to my house. Indeed a fine dwelling you have here, lad. User yes, left mate. your channel. Perhaps oh, take okay. shoe. It's alright, mate, it's alright. It's hard floor, mate. Easy to grub off. Hmm. Laser, feel free to have a look around. Man has claimed fire for home. Mmm. Keep yourself nice and warm after a journey. You're quite the pianist. Well, sometimes you have spare time in your life, so you go and make some tunes. <laughs> ah, it's been what a long think, time Pony? since I've heard a song like this. Oh, I'm sorry, that one. Oh. It's alright. It's alright. You know, I thought you'd be more of the uh, gambling type author. I do gamble. Yeah. I also do other things too. Man can last time I gambled, me. I think I won uh, four hundred dollars last time I'm gambling. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I see you have bed near window. It's a, it's a chair, brother. Some people like to sit on it and just relax, you know. Oh, with many cushions. Mm. Yeah, it's nice and soft. Mm. 
Yep. <laughs> you have house. That feels than nice. <laughs> yeah, mate. Funny how it works. Your fountains are quite a fit swimming pool. Uh, Hendrick's at the door, oh. I believe. I sent him a pigeon a while ago. Oh. Oh, Mr. Long, how are you, brother? Oh, very good. I just got lost in the house, so big. Ah, don't worry, mate. Yeah. This yeah, house cost us a lot of money. Oh. It's the size of twice saloon. I would assume mate, it it's probably money. bigger than the whole of Valentine, to be honest, mate. Let's be real. Howdy. Howdy, friend. Ah, you brought Skinny along as well. We were worried Smart about you. It's quite a... Uh, a large User estate. joined your channel. To hell place. This is Arthur's place. Arthur. Mr. Fancy Hat? Yep, Mr. Fancy Hat. We found the stragglers. Alright, people. Welcome yeah. to me home. Pleasure. Thank Hello. you. We... We had a fall over. I didn't see him and I kind of fell into him. After we toppled, we didn't know where everyone was. So we just followed the road. Oh, it's alright then, mate. It's alright. Alright. We were a bit worried about you, but you made it in one piece. Of course. What do you mean? You think I you have dealt with me? Happened to us. How about we go inside? A nice man's letting us in. Okay. Do I need a bath first? I mean, if you, if you really want to, mate. Yeah, you could go and jump in the fountain. Clean. Yeah, it's freshly clean, brother. Have a wash. They have seen glass. They have a real mirrors in here. Wow. I don't even have windows. Did Takota no, go down to the pants store there? I think so. Aye. Looks like he's buying himself some new treads. You look very angry walking around. Do I look like I'm pacing? Angrily. You look like you're about to go stab someone. Where did Koda go? Oh, don't know, mate. He's just oh, wandered I, off somewhere. I think he went to go buy himself some new pants. Oh, oh yeah. He did yeah. say he wanted pants. Someone told him not to wear his. I offered him mine, but he didn't want them. I think that covered his entire big. body, mate. Yeah. Yep, like oh. I said, you could hide me in those bastards. Literally, yeah. He oh, said the he, same unfortunately, thing. I think I have to go rescue Heinrich. I think he got bucked by his horse. Oh, oh, no. Duty <laughs> calls. Tiki is like a rattlesnake in the grass. Out to hunt the hunter. Bed it. There's two. And there's three. Yeah, you want some more? Come back here. You will not escape me. Oh. Yep. Y'all coming with me. Mm hmm. Brian eyes in this town. Not too sure if I want to be here with these people. You sure? You yeah, 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 fucking leprechaun. Leprechaun blood. Everyone knows that horses don't like we, leprechauns. Hey, I'm pretty sure if we catch them, we get like a wish or something. Oh. I don't yeah. think that's very true, laddie. Every time we see a rainbow, we go to the end of it. Then the fucking, we can't get to the window, you know? Where's well, that would just make you a fucking dumbass, wouldn't it? <laughs> nah, 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 mate. Nah. 
we, we know that leprechauns know where the end of the rainbow is. Lead us to the end of the rainbow, mate. Right? Yeah. Take All right, Levitt, there, if you really want to know where the end of the rainbow is. Yeah. Ah, where's the rainbow? That the way. Rainbow? But there's no rainbow there. As far as you can fucking go, laddie. We talking pots of gold here, or? The fuck? Yep, many pots of gold out that way. As far oh. as you can fucking go. Nah, 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 mate. I've been down that way. That's Mexico. <laughs> you know. You know what? You fucking deserve. So a right a old good punch yeah, in the a, fucking yep, dick. Not, a, yep, a pot of gold. Yep. Oh, I can't. See. I can't even fucking reach your face. <laughs> Get out of here! Get out of here, you fucking bastard! <laughs> okay, yeah, I'll come. Get out, yes! Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought. Let me give you one for that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. you know, see, it didn't even fucking hurt. That's fucking karma, though. Ah, okay. You what am I, the, the fucking town show now? Hey! Oh, boots to your face. You just better be fucking paying for this. Did Skinny and Horse find their way? Yes, they did, actually. Not too long after you left to find your pants. Hmm. Small world. Perhaps you would like to hear the story of Mooger, the silver toothed beaver. Can't say I've heard that one. Go ahead. Seems like an interesting one. In my culture, it is a story to warn children of gluttony, wanting for too much and not giving anything back to earth. Typically, the beaver creature wants wood. Simple life, damn water, build family. But one day, Mooger the Silver Toothed Beaver wanted more of his life. Began mining and panning for gold, using his teeth to warn off other predators. Aww. Amassing fortunes, he dammed the river at both ends, leading to all the fish to die. His food source was gone, and before na before long. Wood was gone too. Beaver died of his own cause and starved himself. Seems like a tale of man, if you ask me. Tale Almost. of white man. Yes. Indeed, it's a shame I have to be among them. I can't say User I've been invited the amongst them, though. You know, because of my stature and all. For white man, Red Wolf, you are wild. Indeed, I like to say so. I like to keep it that way. It's an honest nature. That is the beaver's nature. That is the good nature. What about you, friend? Any stories from home? Not many, I can't say, besides out on the ocean. Oh, sailor story. You Tell me a story of whaling. A story of whaling. Well, my friend, I can't say I'm much of a storyteller, but I'll try. Have you heard of the great tale of Moby Dick? Hmm. Can't say that it's Moby Dick was indeed a great whale. Whales of normal size probably get to the size of about... Hmm... I can't find anything in nature to compare it to here. Maybe... Bigger than carriage. Bigger than carriage indeed. Maybe four. This whale was the size of maybe 16 carriages. One Goliath of creature. Indeed, nothing of its like has ever been seen before. I was told by one of my sailing partners that he was on the crew when they witnessed this great beast. They had caught a few. It was a good evening for them. But at the end of the day, this great behemoth came in to protect its flock. Aye, it did some damage to their ship. They barely escaped their endeavor alive. If it weren't for the great captaining of their captain. Yes, they had a great captain. And he 
charted them to victory. <laughs> this sounds like scary stories. Man must have only just escaped with his life. I mean, I can't recall all the details, but I think you know where I'm heading with this one. This would make a very good book. I mean, I kept it short and simple just in time. We got to town just as a finish, you know? Hmm. Perhaps you are a storyteller. Don't know what Maybe in the making. I think I need a few tips and tricks from you. The best advice I have is add pauses. I will please pause. Can help story. Oh! Well, that was a close one. Man almost crushed you with a wheel. Moment like that needs a moment of pause sometimes. Agreed. That fella has a hat like me. Oh. There is oh, yeah. of them with hats like me. Oh, that's never cool. Ah, oh, well, you've stolen my my fashion now, have you? All right. Greetings, everyone. Hello, Dakota. Is it, sorry, is it Dakota or Takota? Takota. T oh. for tree. Yeah, yeah. We'll be right back, must check bank. Oh, you use the white man system. Oh, yes. Indoctrinated. <laughs> no. Oh, well. Indoctrinated. Fucking go around. Look, look how much space is over there, mate. Fucking so much space. Yeah, I kind around. of agree with him. What are you doing, you silly bastard? Why are you waiting Fucking here? Fucking idiot. Here. Yeah, yeah that, that's the way. Yeah, yeah. Fuck you. Yeah, what are you even doing, you bastard? Oh, no, he's got a gun. Yeah, look at him. Look at him. He's just lying down on the ground in the dirt. Yeah, that's oh. where you belong, mate. Yeah. Okay. Dirty oh, Holy no. Holy shit, where the fuck did he go? User joined your channel. Holy shit. Oh shit, he's gone wild. He's gone absolutely wild. Take him down. Wait, what is, what is this? I'm seeing another zippy. Hmm. Mate, what is, what do you what? call your raccoon? What do you mean, pal? Well, I call mine raccoon zippy. He was my best friend. Ooh. I haven't got a name for mine yet, actually. I'm getting fucking Ooh. shot at. Fucking what is going on around here? Oh mate, this is just a regular occurrence in all Valentine. I mean, I do like your hat though, sir. Oh, I like your hat too. But I would recommend giving your hat a name. Well, I mean, if you didn't have a relationship with your coon, then what would you do? Yep, well, I, I, I mean, I didn't have a relationship with this. I hope you didn't have a serious relationship with yours. Well, mine was, mine was quite serious. He, <laughs> he helped me out through a tough time in my life. Oh, that's understandable then, laddie. Yeah. I mean, I just hunted this one out in the forest over there. Oh, what, I, oh, I mean, well, yeah, a man has to do what he has to do. Yeah, gotta no, do what you have to do. Well, I was using Zippy as a pillow. I know. Uh, yeah, he, in the, in the dead of night, he bit me in the neck. <laughs> With craziness in his eyes, and I had to punch him in the face. That's how I got these. <laughs> Your hands were all... ...mauled up. Yeah, yeah, you know, little tyke, yeah, he didn't, he didn't take one punch, he just, uh, he kept biting. <laughs> this is indeed a tale unfolding that I didn't quite expect. Neither did I, mate, at the time, <laughs> but, I mean, here we are. Here we are, indeed. What is that man doing, sneaking? Ooh, I believe that's sneaky beaky. Oh wait, no it's not. I was just buying some ammo. Would you like to lift planks with me? I don't see why not. I will give it a try. You first must talk this man here. User left your channel. My advice is compliment his mustache. He's more money. Mustache is looking... Extra oil today, sir. Yup, indeed. This mustache is quite a curly one. Perhaps work on compliment. I will. It's not as exciting as hunting, but it's a lot safer. Indeed. Until you go and tear a limb or something. 
Oh, until you don't have nimble fingers and hit hand with hammer. Yeah, I wouldn't like to do that with these small hands. I might crush my whole hand. Ooh, sore man put nail through thumb. Was not pretty. Be prepared. Nails come fast. I didn't quite expect this. Indeed, more manual labor than uh, gold panning. Can be difficult and dangerous for fun. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Been a long time since I've been doing manual labor like this. Mm -hmm. Is similar to gold pen. In a way, I guess, but really you just shake the pan about and look for things. Oh. Like silver tooth beaver. A bit like that, yeah. Whoopsie, I think I dropped it. Can't run on the job there. Hmm, <laughs> I should have warned you. Have done that myself, slipped in mud. Dropped and damaged wood. Well, at least you damaged the wood and not your face. This one has already been damaged. He's actually a funny story. Was drinking from river and salmon jumped out, slaps me in face. Was angry and began to chase slam salmon. Did not realize grizzly bear sneaking up behind me. If that fish did not slap my face, I would have been mauled. Fish slap me in face. I turn around. Bear gets good swipe, but I have enough time to run. I mean, I guess that fish is a good luck charm. You should have went back and captured it. Ooh, if I could wear fish on head, I would. Met man who said red hair is color of gypsy. Spell man. Witch doctor. Do you believe in... Hmm, his word was... Voodoo. Voodoo. Can't say I've heard of it where I come from. I think we just call it magic. Black magic. Mm. Not too sure if I believe it. Most people think I'm magical. No. They believe in spirits. I mean, they think I give them gold. There's a small creature called a leprechaun. I don't know if you've heard of it. Leprechaun. I mean, that's a story I could tell you. A little, small, woodland creature. Looks much like a man. Wears a green suit. Rumored to sit at the end of a rainbow on a pot of gold. If you travel to the end of the rainbow, you are now a rich man. But no one can never seem to find the leprechaun. So the townspeople of Valentine think that's funny to make jokes about me being the leprechaun. Yet you do not sit on leprechaun on rainbow or evade people. That is what I try to tell them, but you know, what can you do? 